In the vast silence of deep space, Voyager 1, humanity's farthest explorer, was expected to fade quietly into oblivion. But on September 8, 2025, a final unexpected burst of data reached Earth, a message so structured and strange it stunned the scientific world. This wasn't a malfunction or a dying gasp. It was a complex, patterned signal, hinting at a fundamental property of space-time beyond our current understanding. At NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, disbelief turned to awe as diagnostics confirmed the data's precision and intelligence. The signal, faint but unmistakable, forced us to reconsider the very fabric of reality. Now, this last transmission is the most intensely studied data in modern astronomy, a puzzle from over 16 billion miles away. Its implications are staggering, suggesting our grasp of the universe is far from complete. Voyager, launched in an era of vinyl records, has sent a final postcard from the edge of knowledge. It challenges us to look deeper, reminding us that the greatest discoveries often come from the most unexpected places. To grasp the weight of Voyager's final message, we must remember the mission's origins. Launched in 1977, Voyager 1 and 2 embarked on a grand tour of the outer planets, using a rare planetary alignment to slingshot from world to world. Despite their primitive technology, these probes revealed volcanic moons, Saturn's intricate rings, Uranus's tilted magnetism, and Neptune's raging storms. After their planetary encounters, both voyagers set course for interstellar space, becoming the first human-made objects to cross the Sun's boundary. Since 2012 and 2018, they've sampled the interstellar medium, tasting the cosmic winds between stars. Their endurance is a testament to human ingenuity and curiosity, operating decades beyond expectations. Every bit of data is a precious glimpse into our place in the cosmos. These probes are not just machines, they are our eyes and ears in the great unknown. Their journey is humanity's journey, a reminder of what we achieve when we dare to explore. Voyager's discoveries belong to all of us, inspiring generations to look outward. And now, with this final message, their legacy grows even deeper. The Voyager's odyssey began in 1977. Voyager 2 first, then Voyager 1 on a faster path. Voyager 1 visited Jupiter and Saturn, then veered north, sacrificing further planetary encounters for a direct route to interstellar space. Voyager 2 took the scenic route, flying by all four gas giants and sending back humanity's first close-ups of these distant worlds. After Neptune, both probes sailed toward the edge of the Sun's influence, each on a unique trajectory. They crossed the turbulent heliosphere, braving the chaotic boundary where solar wind meets interstellar space. Finally, they entered the calm, cold expanse beyond, the true interstellar medium. Today, Voyager 1 is over 16 billion miles from Earth, Voyager 2 over 13 billion. Their journey is a powerful visualization of our cosmic neighborhood's vastness. Like tiny ships leaving familiar shores, they now drift in the endless ocean between stars. Each Voyager carries a unique artifact, the Golden Record, a message for any intelligent life that might find the probes. This gold-plated disc, championed by Carl Sagan, contains images and sounds portraying Earth's diversity. It includes greetings in 55 languages, natural sounds, and music from around the world, from Bach to Chuck Berry, Navajo chants to Javanese gamelan. The record is a time capsule designed to last a billion years, symbolizing hope and optimism. It's more than a message for aliens. It's a reflection of ourselves, a snapshot of what we value most. The golden record forced us to consider how we wish to be remembered. As the voyagers drift through interstellar space, the records endure as silent ambassadors. Long after the probes fall silent, these disks will carry a portrait of Earth on an endless journey. They are a testament to our desire to connect, even across the cosmic void. Communicating with Voyager, billions of miles away, is a marvel of engineering. NASA's Deep Space Network, three massive antenna complexes around the globe, serves as Earth's ears to the cosmos. These giant dishes capture Voyager's faint signals, amplifying and decoding them with extraordinary precision. Commands sent from Earth take nearly a day to reach the probe, and the return signal is weaker than a whisper in a storm. This tenuous electronic thread has kept us connected to our most distant explorers for decades. 
It's a triumph of human persistence and ingenuity, bridging the vastness of space. For years, Voyager 1's data was routine, until September 8, 2025. That day, a standard telemetry packet was followed by a structured, repeating binary pattern, unlike anything seen before. The signal was pristine, cycling every 4.2 seconds, a precision no malfunction could explain. Analysis revealed mathematical ratios, not tied to any known measurement, but describing a relationship between space-time density and the quantum state of hydrogen atoms. This hinted at a direct link between gravity and quantum mechanics, the holy grail of physics. The data suggested space-time isn't smooth, but subtly textured, interacting with matter in ways we never imagined. How could Voyager's 1970s instruments detect this? If real, the discovery means our model of the cosmos is fundamentally incomplete. The probe, on the brink of silence, had stumbled upon a new layer of reality. Scientists were left stunned, questioning everything they thought they knew. Voyager's final act was its most astonishing. The world's top physicists mobilized to decode Voyager's message, ruling out every conceivable error. The odds of a malfunction producing such a mathematically complex signal were infinitesimal. The leading theory, Voyager, by sheer luck, detected quantum-scale ripples in space-time, microscopic vibrations that bridge gravity and quantum mechanics. Its plasma instrument, never designed for this, happened to overlap with the frequency of this new phenomenon. If true, this is the first experimental evidence linking the universe's largest and smallest scales. Ironically, the breakthrough came not from a billion-dollar experiment, but from a decades-old probe drifting alone in the dark. Voyager's discovery is redrawing our map of the cosmos. Interstellar space, once thought empty, is now revealed as a dynamic, textured quantum sea. This new data may offer clues to dark matter and dark energy, mysteries that have eluded detection for decades. Some speculate that space-time's texture could explain these phenomena, turning wild theories into testable ideas. The discovery opens new avenues for exploration. Future probes could map space-time's structure, creating a weather map of the interstellar medium. Practical applications may be distant, but the potential is revolutionary, even for propulsion. Voyager's final message reminds us that the universe is more complex and wondrous than we imagined. We are only beginning to scratch the surface. The cosmos is a place of profound mystery, and Voyager has pulled back the curtain just a little. There are new laws of physics waiting to be discovered, even in the emptiness between the stars. As Voyager 1's final transmission fades, we're left to ponder its legacy. The mission gave us our first close-ups of the giant planets, then ventured into the interstellar void as humanity's silent ambassador. The golden record carries our story, but this last, cryptic message may be its greatest gift. Voyager's discovery will shape science for generations, opening doors to a deeper understanding of reality. It proves the value of pure exploration, returns that are unpredictable yet immeasurably vast. Now, Voyager drifts on, a ghost ship in the Milky Way, outlasting us all. Will its legacy be the golden record or the key to a new universe? Perhaps both a testament to our curiosity, and a whisper across the cosmic ocean.